Um, reading Peter Orbin's piece in, on the website, um, he cites this game as um, one of the the twists and turns of the season. Bottom plays top. Couldn't be harder for us. No, uh, you know it's football, isn't it? You know, like if you was uh, if you was a betting man, you want to get bets on it. We're probably like you know. Uh, you know, seven to four on for the win, and they're uh, probably like you know, fifty to one or whatever, you know. So, but you know, let's not uh, remember. You know, like two seasons ago, Sporting Bengal went to Maidstone, won one nil. Uh, they, I know, we've beaten them seven uh, up there already this year. But you know, anyone who's at the game, they give us a good first half, you know. And then we, after we won one nil up, they hit the post. Fury's had to put off a good save. And you know, they're just a the sort of side though. If you get a couple in front, they sort of tend to lose a little bit of discipline. But if we go out there with the uh, the wrong attitude, if we go out there with any complacency, you know we're going to come unstuck. But you know and that's where uh, you know that's where it's my job to uh, make sure that we don't do that. And uh, you know everyone thinks the manager's job is just about like picking a side, but it's not that. You know it's about making sure that the players are fully focused, making sure they go out there with the right attitudes, uh, making sure that we do pick the right team. You know and we you know, we'll be at full strength this weekend and. Uh, uh, yes, we fully expect to go out there and get three points. Everyone does that to the league positions. But you have to work for everything you know, you swallow the table at the moment because we've worked. We've worked hard every single game. Every, we've put uh, so much effort in. You see the lads here tonight, they'll be working hard again tonight. And uh, that's a mark of a good side. You know, The good sides, once all, are the ones that work harder. You know, that work harder than everyone else. And, uh, and that's what we're looking to do. I think a measure of the potential problem we've done with, you know, on this next game is um, Roll they beat Faversham. Well, you know, can upset anyone. Any team can upset anyone on the day. Well, you know, that's what makes football scary. That's why you always get like, you know, the, the little, the, the, the minnows, if you like. Uh, you know, let, let's not forget. Yeah, this Sporting Bengal were getting beat every week, and then they, you know, Earn Bay were going for a title, and they come down here and beat them seven-one. You know, the thing is with uh, clubs like Sporting Bengal, you, you never know what's, what team you're going to play against. You know, and on their day, they can uh, they can upset people. But you know, but, but all we do, we just stay, uh, we stay fully focused on our job. And, uh, and that's what we do, like the same as we do every week. Like I say, we'll be treating this the same as we would Thames Mead. And uh, you know, they get our, they get our uh, utmost respect. And uh, and whether it's one nil, two nil, five four, whatever, as long as we can't away there for three points on Saturday, I'll be happy. Absolutely. And um, just to focus on uh, on the training here tonight, have you got any injury worries at all? Well, Gary say a lot missed Saturday. Sitting through, uh, through an injury, he's just had a bit of treatment. He'll be like light jogging that tonight. Hopefully, he'll be available for selection on Saturday. Uh, but apart from that, you know, we're back to full strength, you know, and uh, and you can see how strong the squad we got. You know, when you, you know, like Saturday, you know, you had Josh Main playing for reserves, Sam Prep playing for reserves, you know, and uh, you know, and like Mark Cox been playing for reserves, and Mickey Lane has, you know, so it shows that we've got a, a strong squad. You know, and uh, and it, but I've always said though, you know, a squad winger, a squad winger things. You know, and that to where we are, we ain't won nothing yet. But at this precise moment, we're ten points clear, and it's the squad that's done it. And uh, and the squad have worked hard, and, uh, and and we do try and take what we think is our six, best sixteen for that particular game. And the ones who aren't in it always go with the reserves, and they always show great attitudes. Yes, they're disappointed not to be with the first team. But they're uh, they're professional enough to know that they're there for a reason. And that's to get their fitness and get back in my changing room as quickly as possible. And, uh, and, and you know, and uh, Ian Osick tells me all the time that all the first team lads that go down always show a great attitude. And uh, and that's great for for me as a manager to hear that. Well, that's a nice note to finish on, Mark. Thanks very much. Cheers, Tony. Thank Bye. You. Just remind everybody. You